Yet another claim to the presidency. Drama unfolded outside the state television headquarters when opposition politician Saran Serem tried to announce that she was in control of the West African country. She would be ready to accept your mission, but she doesn't want to appear to be stealing it. She wants it to be done with the consent from all those who have fought to get there. She doesn't want treason. It has to be a decision agreed by all those who fought. Not long after, military vehicles appeared outside the headquarters and gunfire erupted, sending people fleeing for cover. We are attached to all political forces, the political parties, the civil societies. We will have transparent elections. At least one person was killed in the melee. In the aftermath of the gunfire, the military made a show of force by deploying armored vehicles along all of the avenues leading to the national television and radio station offices. About a thousand people had gathered at the Place des Nations in Burkina Faso's capital on Sunday to ask for a civilian and democratic transition amid confusion over who is running the country. We want to preserve the gains of democracy. We want and need a democracy for people that will not be betrayed. Blaise Campore resigned and fled to Cote d'Ivoire after protesters scorched parliament buildings in a show of anger over his bid to amend the constitution so he could seek a fifth presidential term. Maria Galang, CCTV.